Jaguars and Rams coming to you from the Rams Dome, the site for today's game. I don't know which team has the better tight end, but I do know that that could very well be the difference in this game today. Well, if you made me choose between the two, I'll tell you what. I'll just say you take one. I don't care who you take. I'll take the other one because they're both that good. They can do it all. As I say, you hear me say it every once in a while. They're all in one. That means they can do anything you want. Johnson's going to test the coverage this time. Falls on the ground. Tackles made. Well, that's nothing but just, uh, that, that's just luck. That's all you can say. You're the return team. They fumble the football. It bounces out, and they get it back. they lucky there. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. The Rams defense packs it in now, going with the 46. The Rams defense lined up in a 4-6 formation. Eyeing that left side, the tackle was made. The Jaguars did a good job that time keeping the defense off balance. They throw the football, they pick up some solid yards now, and they can choose from run or pass. And here we have second down. The Rams load up the box, going with the 46 defense. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Well, we got the mojo flowing today, don't we? You start out the game, it's early. You pick up a couple first downs, and you think you can't be stopped. They're able to move the chains after that last run. He takes it on the counter. He's tackled right at the 31. Taking a look at the offensive starters out of Mount Union, a fourth-round pick in 2011, Cecil Shorts. There are players at every school, regardless of what level they're playing at in college. How about that? Mount Union, Cecil Shorts, fast, tough. He can be a force in the NFL. lineup he's been flying around the field since coming out of Ohio State in 2009 James Laurinaitis you said it right he can fly around the field he looks the part of a middle linebacker and he can sure act the part too can he he can make the tackles he's tough he's smart one of the best middle linebackers in the NFL third and nine and he's forced to the ground well, I don't know who made the mistake that time. The quarterback or the running backs, they go out on the pass. The blitz comes by the defense. Not enough blockers on the offensive side. And the defense wins out, and they take the QB down. The coach is going to go for it. The Jaguars take it from the 23. Down the field, makes the catch deep down the middle of the field. The Rams might have been caught off guard there on that fourth down play. Well, why? Why would you be caught off guard in a situation like this? You always have to be ready on the defensive side. That time they were not. First down, following the long play. out and grabs it. Gains 11. Wide receivers get scared sometimes running that slant route. They know their linebackers inside running towards them because they're watching the quarterback's eyes. First down at the 25. Handoff made. They knock him down and he's still two yards short of the first. Always good to have these types of runs. Hey, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Second down, two to go. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. First down by the offense in the red zone. And, you know, if you're on the defensive side, you don't have to worry about deep passes anymore. You can be more aggressive and take some chances. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. This has been a long drive so far. What a drive this has been. Another carry here. And gained about one. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Find shorts. Touchdown. Jacksonville Jags. 
Good job that time by the offense, scoring that touchdown and putting him ahead. And when you get ahead in a football game, the National Football League, it makes you relax and you play better. The Rams are ready to return the kick. Austin will test the coverage. And they're all over him at the 18-yard line. First down here. It's Bradford out of the pistol. They motion the receiver around to the other side. First and ten. Here's the handoff. Now makes the move to the right. Balls there to make the stop. It's now second down. The Jaguars defense lined up going with the 46 defense. Trying to beat the play clock. Bradford's got it in the gun. What catch! Blackman there to take it down. After the long game, let's see what they do here. The wide receiver in motion. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. And he's hackled at the 34-yard line. Second down. Bradford's going to be in the pistol here. The Rams still possess the football as we begin the second quarter. After the two-yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. The Jaguars packing the box here. 46 formation. Has his target. Brought down by Clemens. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. The Jaguars out now in a 4-6 formation. Looking across the middle. And he's going to be tackled. And that's going to bring us to fourth down. They bring back out the offense to go for it. Big set here for the defense. Lining up in the 4-6. Here we go. The Rams from the 32. Ooh, they failed to pick up the first, and the ball will go back to the other side. Well, it's a good thing that linebacker knocked that pass down, because I don't think he could have caught it. So if you can't catch it, knock it down so nobody else can catch it. The Jaguars now will start their drive at the 32. The Jaguars from the 32. Hand off. And it's James Laurinaitis in on the tackle. That leads us to second down. Still on his feet. That ball has been picked off. It's wide open. Scores the touchdown. Got to love the defense. It's not afraid to take chances. And this defense will get after it. That time they get the interception and return it all the way for a touchdown. Extra point is good. Rams ready to boot the football down the field. Odman will run this one out. Tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. They face first down. Offense lines up here. Out to the left. On the money. The game may be five. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws sooner or later that defense is going to come up and when they come up that's when you throw it over the top
This will be second down. Here's the handoff and they'll run it. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. Gerhardt's a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances. Nickel formation for the defense here. Now first and ten. They'll go ground. And they tap him down at the 37-yard line. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go. And they stop him for a short game. Second down coming up. Offense lines up here. He's going to get another carry. Trying to find an opening to the right. And that's good for only a yard or two. This is third down. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. That catch will extend the drive. The defense thinks they have the guys to play man-to-man -man coverage down the field. Well, they didn't that time. The receiver made a nice little move, gets open, and a good throw by the quarterback. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. That long game sets them up here on this play. Here's the first snap after the big play. The give. Game five. And we've reached the two-minute warning. Number 21 on the Play number six coming up on this drive. Second and goal from the five. Takes another handoff. That'll stop the play right there. It's getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? They, they better be creative. That's all I know. a foot away. Hey, 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 hey. Defense comes out in a 4-6 formation. And he's in for the touchdown. Well, the defense knew that they were probably going to see a run here in third and goal. And what do they do? They don't, it doesn't matter. They still get blown off the line of scrimmage by the offensive line. Nice job. Josh Scoby ready for the kickoff. He'll take it from the one. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. They come to the line and it's first down. They'll go ground. Right side. And a gain of four. That was a power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. Tackle down right around the 47. Again, this time it's a halfback screen. Nice job by the quarterback. The halfback, good job after catching it, picked up some good yards. First and ten. Airing it out. And he's intercepted. Nice tackle. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. First down. Offense readying for the snap. Lee's lined up in the slot. Joiner's able to get a hand on it and knock it away. That was an incomplete pass that time against cover two, the two deep safeties. And 
you really want to throw the football down the middle or deep down the sidelines. That time the quarterback didn't do that, and that's why it was incomplete. Second down now. Portals back in shotgun formation. The hit knocks the ball out incomplete. The Jaguars signal for the timeout. And that's the first one they've used. Following that incompletion, it sets up third and ten. Short's got it on a pass that had some heat. Well, when you play in this cover three defense where three defenders are playing deep, that's great. You stop the deep passes, but who's going to stop the quick ones? Well, nobody. That's why the quarterback and the receivers are having really good success throwing these slam patterns. Lee's going to get set in the slot for the snap. Portal standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. The defense gets a sack. Well, that was an aggressive play by the defense. That's risk-reward. So the reward, of course, is sacking the quarterback like they did. Well, the risk is if you don't get there, you could give up a big play. So that's going to do it for the first half here. Jaguars are up in this one. All right, Larry, thank you for all of those updates. And now the teams are coming back onto the field, and we're about to get the second half started. Austin's got it on the fair catch as the offense heads out now. First down on the way. Bradford's setting up now in the pistol. Second half gets rolling now as he takes the snap. They'll mark him at the 29. They're going to the hurry. Back to the line now. The Rams have it at the 29. Gets the handle here. The tackle is made at the 40-yard line. The Rams look pretty confident out there on the field, don't they? And they're, they're very calm, and they should be. That first down, they're right in this game. Down a couple points here in the second half. Don't look down the field for that big play. Just keep marching. Rams offensive line will be whooping it up tomorrow when they watch this play in the field room. What a good job by them. Excellent planning and awesome execution. First down here after the run. Here they come back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. To the ground. That's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Second down and 11. They'll run it here. Rick's free. Takes it the distance for the touchdown. Well, that score ties the game up. Now, on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. Add the extra point. The kick is good. Rams ready to boot the football down the field. Johnson's running this one out. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Jaguars now will start their drive at the 23. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. The Jaguars take it from the 23. He's got the catch. Taken down at the 33. Anytime you have man-to-man -man coverage like we see this time, it's all about the receiver getting away from the defender. He does it, and the quarterback puts it right on. The Jaguars take it from the 33. Breaks at the tackle. Ball's picked off. Still not on his way. The 10 in stride, and he's caught for the touchdown. Well, I really have no complaints. 
sometimes you're going to throw interceptions, but my complaint is the offensive players. Nobody hustling, nobody there to make the tackle, and they return it all the way for a touchdown. Rams ready to boot the football down the field. Odman will run this one out. And he's out across the 20 and tackled at the 21. First down here. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. He's in for the touchdown. Well, here we are. It's a tie game now. We'll see how the teams react to it. Will it be positive or negative? The Jaguars now will tack on the extra point. The point after try is in the books. The Rams are ready to return the kick. Austin's going to test the coverage here. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. First down coming up. Bradford set in the pistol. Handoff made. Reynolds all over the ball carrier. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. Second down and 12. They're going to get him here for a sack. Well, I know this feeling. When a blitzer's coming, nobody's there to block him. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. Can they overcome the sack? Third down on the way. Here's the handoff. Space to work. He's going to be brought down going to be a three and out for this offense defensive coordinators love this situation don't they third and long they can do just about anything it's going to work and they stop the offense that time that's a failed conversion but you might as well look at it like a turnover it's going back the other way when you decide to go for it on fourth down as a head coach you got to realize there's, you're going to be one of two things. You're going to be a genius or an idiot. And if you don't make it, look out. The second guessing begins. First down and 10. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, good job that time by the defense. They catch the offense off guard. And they send more guys than the offensive line can block. When you're outnumbered, it's up to the quarterback to get rid of the football. He does it, and he takes the sack. Robinson's in the slot. The Jaguars will take the snap from the 25. It's Lee. Well, when you have a tie game and you're down in the red zone, you can do whatever you want. You can fool them with the run here, or you can take a chance and throw the football in the end zone to get a score. Empty backfield look for Bortles here. Third and four. Looks to his left. Jacksonville in the end zone for the touchdown. And what a touchdown there for the offense. The quarterback just fires that football in there. Look at the defenders around the receiver. But the receiver, big enough, tough enough to go up in there and make that catch. Josh Scobie ready for the kickoff.
the Rams come onto the field for their next series. Offense lines up here. First down at the 18. We'll run it. Here's the handoff. He's brought down at the 20-yard line. Second down here. They hurry to the line of scrimmage. Hey, hey. Here we go now. Left, 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 left. Bradford's going to take it from the gun. Down the field. And Grats nearly had the interception. I know we've all heard this phrase before. defense because they can't catch hey the coaches don't care about that when you get an opportunity they want you to make the catch Here we go now. Go, go, go. Bradford's gonna take the snap from the shotgun looking long almost intercepted the defense did an awesome job that time. They had the right defense called, and that time the defender almost picked off the pass. Good job by the defense. Offense is still on the field here. On fourth down, needing eight yards for the first. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Gain 17. Well, I think we all know the situation here. It's a close game in the second half, and you're losing. But you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities of what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. And now they're in the hurry up. Second down and two. Throws to the right. Catch made. Game 18. Bradford's job is to sell that play fake, and boy, did he do it that time. It fooled the defense, and they get the completion. Offense lines up here. The Rams have the football as the fourth quarter gets started. Play number six coming up on this drive. He'll take the snap, the first here in the fourth quarter. Looking out wide. Good yardage picked up on that ball. Big first down by the offense that time here in the second half. They're losing a close game, and you get that first down. It just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. That picks up 11. Good job by the offense getting in the red zone. Now you're down some points. you got to find a way to score a touchdown. First and goal from the 10. They're setting up screen. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. Coming up, second down. Black 58, right? Black 58, right? Hey, hey. Offense left, lines left, up left. here. Here we go now. Left, 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 left. Left, 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 left. Bradford's got it in the gun. Throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. There's no doubt about it. When you score like that to tie up the game, it shifts momentum. And it's all up now to the offense of the other team to get back out there and get the momentum back on their side. Danielle's got an injury update for us. Let's go to her now. Guys, I just spoke with a Jaguars official. At this point, the medical staff is going to hold him out of this one with what they're still just calling an upper body injury. So, guys, he's out for the day. Back to you. The Jaguars are set now for their next possession. Go, go, go! First and ten. Throw to the left. Got the completion at the gain of six. I think the best thing to say about that play, it's just a, it, it gained a few yards, so that's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. Black 58, Ryan. Black 58. 
Offense lines up here. Second down, four to go. Hand off. Jenkins is in on the tackle. The Jaguars' offensive line is just whooping some tail today, aren't they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space, get down there, and pick up a big game. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. Now first and 10. And the throw is incomplete. Well, your teammates are really going to respect you after something like this. Anytime you're on that field as an athlete, and when you give all your effort to every single play like that time, how about that? Just giving every bit of effort he can to make the catch. Not able to get it. And what a job of it. Portals back in shotgun formation. What a reception. And they are in on shorts. And what a catch that time, partner. Nothing surprises it anymore. These guys are so talented. You're right. Spectacular catch. A reception on second down, but not enough for the first. Third down. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. That's been the story of this game. Another third down conversion to move the chains. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Time is running out. The game is tied, and the defense must do whatever it can to not give up a score. And now they'll try over again on second down. The game is tied, and time is a factor. And knows exactly where he needs to go to pick up the first, and he's got it. What a nice catch by the receiver. Getting past the yard markers, makes the catch, and gets the first down. Two minutes to go before this one's in the books. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Let's see how they back up the big play here. This play set up by the long gainer. Will go ground. Brought down at the 20. Teams in the NFL spend about 30, 40 percent of their time all week long practicing plays in the red zone. So there's a lot they can do here. Let's see if they come up with something that works. Second down and eight. It's Lee, and he's tackled down after picking up the first. When you have an offense like this that just keeeps getting first downs, not only are they moving in scoring position, but they're giving their defense a lot of rest. First down here after the completion. Offense lines up here. First and goal. Hand off out of the eye. That brings the play to an end. The Rams defense will stop the clock here with under two to go because they want to preserve the clock. That's second down coming up. Marching down the field and taking their time. The long drive continues. They call his number once more. They jam it in on the goal line. Touchdown. Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. They got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. It's good. The Rams are ready to return the kick. Fair catch 
first this time. And a touchback. The Rams come to the line, fourth quarter, with two timeouts remaining. Now on first down, every snap crucial the rest of the way. Here we go now. Three, 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 three. Hey, hey. Black 58, right up. Black 58, right First and ten, the give. Can't find space, and this will be a loss of one on the play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Second and 11. Setting up screen. Makes the catch. Nothing there as this goes for a loss of two. The Rams use another timeout here, and they have one left. Huge third and long coming up, and they're certainly in four down territory as well. Third down and 13. Looking to the right side and throwing. Pulls it in. Balls there to make the tackle. The Rams just picked up a big first down that time, Jim. When you're down by a few points in the second half, every first down is crucial. Nice job that time by the offense. First down. Pressure on every snap now. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. The Rams will take the snap from the 35. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. Every quarterback in the NFL is going to have one or two passes a game. They can be picked off. Most of the time they're dropped, and this time that was a bad drop by the defense. They've come out in the dime package. Second down and 10. Sam Bradford going down the field. Intercepted. He's brought down. Good job that time by the defense. Not being full, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. It's first down as they head to the line. Big set here for the defense, lining up in the 4-6. Will go ground, searching for space to the right, and he gains maybe three. Hard sometimes as an offensive coordinator to call plays to catch the defense off guard when you're winning and it's late in the game. Uh, so they played it very predictable there. The defense was ready, nowhere to go. Bill, before we go, how about a little chat about how much this win means? Well, you know, Jim, let's look at it this way. It was just a nice win. It